Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Kevin Holmes with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for Monday, January 20th. Frustration and heartbreak. This after a mass shooting at a Kansas City club. 17 shot, two killed. It happened at the Nine Ultra Night Club. A witness telling 41 Action News the shooter got into an argument and then left to get a gun. Police have ID'd that shooter as Jerron Swift. He was shot and killed by a security officer. A woman, 25 year old Raven Parks, was also shot and killed. The Nine Ultra Lounge released this statement on social media. It says, in part, as we all try and move forward, we will never forget this unfortunate day of loss. Our organization does not believe senseless violence is the answer to resolve any problem. Today, Kansas City Mayor Quentin Lucas said club owners have a responsibility to make sure their patrons stay safe. In the same way that we're talking about what law enforcement, what mayors, what everyone else can do, I think it is a responsibility of every club owner in this city uh, to make sure that they have a safe environment, that they're part of, of fixing those problems. Kansas City mothers calling for an end to all this violence, and they're doing that while honoring Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. today. But the news of last night's shooting is making one leader of KC Mothers in Charge push even harder for that change. I was just immediately just outraged with, with, with our community. Because once again, we can't even have a decent day, a decent time, something good happened for the, happened for the city before we start taking out these guns and killing each other and shooting. That voice you heard is Rosalind Temple. She says people need to come together and do everything they can as King did to bring justice. Gary Lezak with your forecast. Hey, Kevin, down to three degrees in the morning tomorrow, and then we'll go up to 32 degrees in the afternoon. And then snow is back in the forecast Wednesday. Maybe some accumulation. We'll look at the new data later on tonight and up to just above freezing. So it might be a slushy snow this time. Remember, you get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.